WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. Currently, we've got all the indices trading to the upside. Dow's up 249, S&P 21, NASDAQ 12. Russell 17, semis are up five points. But we're going to focus here on the short-term time frame charts. This way, this is going to be able to assist you with understanding what the market is telling you that as far as what it wants to do for the rest of the afternoon. Isn't that a beautiful thing? I think it is. How are we going to do that, Steve? Well, great question. We're going to look at those 30-minute time frame charts. Inside the ES Mini, what we have out here, what you're looking at the chart, is this formed a TD9 count top. It did it um, about an hour ago, and that high is going to be the key high. That key high, I'm trying to get this for you, is uh, 3,700.75. If you see a 30-minute bar close above it, I'm not talking about trading above it, closing back below it. I'm talking about closing above 3,700.75. That's your indication that the ES mini negated that pattern and wants to move higher. To the downside, there's several levels of support. The ultimate level of support on the ES mini is 3,682.75. But watch that high because if price closes above that, then the ES mini definitely is signaling to you and wants to head higher. Now, you might ask that question head higher to where I'm trying to uh, get that answer for you it would be the top of its profile um, just trying to get my charts here to uh, to work with us that price level is 3711 boy it closed above 3711 and uh, that would just be uber not the rideshare company uh, bullish out there the Dow equity future contract has done the same thing now it confirmed its TD nine count at 2 p.m. so the high that you're watching for there is 3182 if price closes above that it tells you about a strong momentum move in the short term time frame and that short term time frame should then take the Dow equity future contract up to the top of its profile and that level is uh, 30 333 out there uh, the Russell 2000 also has a TD nine count we covered that during the last segment of the Traders Edge show let's uh, finish this off by take a look at the NQ no TD nine counts here just consolidating sideways up towards the European opening range and that's at 12 732 75 if the NQ closes above that it's signaling to you that price wants to move higher but everything is set up right now for a sideways move to a pullback and if price closes above those levels, well, then those higher highs should be hit. Folks, stay tuned for uh, two more great hours and uh, have yourself a Merry Christmas. Stay safe out there, and I'll look forward to seeing you on Monday next week. Take care, folks.